Welcome to the Tail Slate. I'm Ben Stacy. I'm here with Dennis Humbleby and Michael Oakes. And we're at the East End Expo right now, and we're going to be talking about the Logan trailer that just came out. Mm. Uh, let's watch it first. Uh, you guys have both seen it. I haven't seen it yet. Yeah, I've seen it about seven times. Oh, about yeah. seven? Only about seven. that, yeah. Only seven. <laughs> okay, well, let, let's watch so I can see what we're talking about. So, like I was mentioning earlier, Logan's not his actual name, which I thought was ironic given the title. Yeah. But. I know, first thing, it's post black and white. Yeah. Clearly. Is he actually that old? I don't know. I mean, I think they're suggesting because he's like. On, like you can see the scars on him. Yeah. I'm wondering if his healing is kind of cut out, so he's starting to age like a normal person. I think I read that he's not actually immortal. He's just yeah. aging really slowly. Yeah, true. Because Patrick Stewart looks. Ooh. Yeah. But he is actually. Old. Yeah. <laughs> oh, is that Patrick Stewart? Yeah. 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 yeah, they made him look even older in this one. Somehow. Yeah. That just doesn't age. Yeah, I know. That's 20 years ago, exactly the same. Who was that? I think that was uh, Professor X. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, who's that? Little girl? She's the kind of mystery main character. Yeah. She's important for some reason. I know, I didn't actually catch it probably every single time I watched it. I can't really see it properly, but does he have his metal claws back? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Again, March third, mm. which is awesome. My birthday, yeah. almost. Oh, is it your birthday? Almost. Oh, or well, it's not officially your birthday. Yeah. <laughs> now, I don't know if you heard it in that, um, but they actually said the mutants are gone. Yeah. Like completely. Um, <laughs> well, not thing, all of them, obviously. Well, he he just well, says the Stewart's mutants thing. are gone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So uh, whatever that entails, whether or not they're almost extinct or whatever, uh, as you can clearly see, people are hunting them. Yeah. So there's probably been like an another event where they try to make the sentinels but not sentinels anymore it's just humans yeah. going after yeah. the mutants um so i'm i'm curious as to what happens yeah well, well that's very... interesting they, they didn't give away obviously too much in terms of story we've just seen yeah, yeah. Uh, no we have no idea who the that girl there. is we've got professor x there yeah uh logan still yeah got his claws yeah well, the theory was, I remember when this movie was being talked about or like in early production, was that it was going to be an adaptation of Old Man Logan, which was a comic that was much more in the context of the larger Marvel universe. Yeah. So, um, do you guys know about the story from the comics? That's comic? unfortunately one I have not read at no. all. Okay. Uh, am I all right to like yeah, yeah, do yeah. like the broad Spoil strokes? Away. Spoil away. So, uh, yeah, it was basically set in the future and it kind of took Mark Miller's, because it was written by Mark Miller, and it took his idea that he had in Wanted, where it's kind of like the villains win. Yeah. And so the villains win, and then they kind of split America up into districts and they have control. And Logan hasn't used his claws in years because of a traumatic incident that he's okay. gone through. Yeah. And so in the comic, it's revealed later on that the incident is he actually was mind controlled into killing all the X Men. Oh, wow. So I'm curious whether or not they're taking elements from the con how much are they so taking? So maybe they're all gone because because he of Logan killed them, that and that's maybe why he's so sullen and kind of broken down. Wow, that would um, be pretty dark. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the only other detail I can say is that the little girl that shows up in the trailer yeah. is that uh, I believe it's I don't know for sure if it's been confirmed, but I believe it's been heavily suggested that it's X-23 from the comics, which is the female clone of Wolverine. Oh. So you okay. see, there's like brief glimpses where you see like him being attacked by somebody with claws. Mm. That's supposed to be her. She has claws just like Wolverine does. Oh. And so she's been conditioned to kind of be a weapon, kind of like how Logan was supposed to be. Right, Weapon X. He yeah. was like the only successful oh, Weapon X. X-23. Yeah, 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 okay. So she's kind of, they, they believe that he's the only successful top trial that they've done yeah. with that Weapon X program. So they basically kind of take his DNA and make a female version of him. Why don't they just make a male version? Like, I mean, the cloning I think, is cloning. I think in the comics it was because they had such heavily, like, a destroyed DNA sample that uh, they could only, like, successfully make a right. female copy. Okay. That makes uh, sense. That's interesting. Well, so, it it look, looks interesting. Yeah. I, obviously, we're probably going to get more yeah. as it gets closer to the day. Mm. That'll give away a little bit more. But And uh, he, uh, Professor X does say, like, she's very similar to you. Yeah. Yeah. So that makes a lot of sense that yeah. she'd be the mm -hmm. same. 
Okay. Yeah. Cool. I do remember hearing a lot of jokes online where people thought it was like the Last of Us movie because he looks <laughs> so much like Joel. Yeah, he does. And she looks kind of like Ellie. Yeah. So it kind of has that play to it, and it's like in this apocalyptic setting. Mm-hmm. Although it's weird, it, it, there's a heavy emphasis on this apocalyptic look. Yeah. But there's like little moments where you see like him at the gravesite, where those cars and everything like yeah. that. So I don't know how much. Like when this takes place in the timeline, yeah. like I the X Men timeline is already confusing. So. I, I think yeah. you might be right as far as the districts go because it, that yeah. would make sense where they have like populated areas where there's yeah. like it's civilized, yeah. and then everywhere else is screwed. Yeah. 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 So yeah. that might be the case. Yeah. yeah. Oh, cool! It looks good. I, yeah. I'm interested to see it, and uh, we just gotta wait now. Until March. Yeah. Yeah. I, was, uh, I was surprised that it like dropped like right on the heels of like Guardians like came out and there's yes. like insert, like there's yeah. one day when like everything seemed to come out. Yeah. And so it was strange that this kind of came out of the blue, but it was great. Yeah, well, that's good. So there you go. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Logan coming out March 4th? 3rd. 3rd. 4th.